I saw Al Sharpton was when I went to Sanford for the march for Trayvon Martin. Oh, wow. Yeah. It was thousands and thousands of people there, so this is going to be so crazy to see him, like... Here in the flesh. Up close and This is him. Oh, my God. We are honored. We're honored. I mean, um, I did have one question. I've been waiting probably my whole life to ask you this. Um, you making me feel old his whole life. Well, you know, no, 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 no. You know, I, I want to ask you what you, what do you do to look so good? For I'd have been more flattered if your wife told me I look good. But well, I, you know what? Hey, I'm a man, man, so uh, it's, it's uh, still good. Uh, uh, and you look absolutely rad. Right. Thank you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Virtual kiss. We got time for another one. No, we don't. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. If I'd have known that at some point I'd be sitting at a table with you talking about something as, as admirable as what we're about to do, you know, for our people, I, I know I, I wouldn't have believed that. So, well, it's beyond admirable yeah. because of the the whole divide of who gets served and not served in the country is in itself an issue. Yes, sir. and for you guys to come testing people, that's a huge statement. Well, and it's a good role model. Our kids. When, when I was growing up, we didn't have doctors look like this. I don't went for checkups all the time if I had a doctor look like this. <laughs>I didn't get your name. Yes, sir. My name is Dr. Contessa Metcalf. I'm a physician as well, and so is my husband. So we sitting there looking out the window. We watched him come in, and I said, that's not him. That was him. When you went and to then the we went down. Both of y'all are doctors. Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's hard to say whether they was fighting or fighting. I don't. I can't call it. You have motivated us so much. All I know is, even for the reverend, she couldn't get her ass downstairs on time. is coming, guys. They stay coming right now. I'll take red, please. Thank you so much. This looks like my favorite restaurant crab cake. Give me the hot sauce. That's delicious. You want some? I will share with you, babe. It's going to be a long night. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, Jackie, now that you are the vagina queen, the research for the book and everything that you did, what's the most amazing thing that you were surprised by? That women are very embarrassed oh about talking about their sexuality. They don't look at it. They don't want to talk about it. I am so disturbed, obviously. I'm like, I want to see what it look like, it tastes like, everything. You want to see how it tastes like? Yes. Oh, oh Lord. <laughs> like, I want to smell everything. I want to uh -uh. I want to know me. One day, I sent Eugene a picture of my vagina when he was at work. No. <laughs> how can I get into another conversation? <laughs> I was sitting on the counter. I was like, no. -uh. Just, mm -hmm. And he was like, don't do that again. If I got my phone, and then all of a sudden, there's a pussy on it. <laughs> You don't see that? That's a problem? Karen would die if I did that. Most men would die if their wives did to them what Toya does. The P word, you can't say I'm pretty TV. sure you can on Can you say the P word on TV? I think you can. Really? Yes. Oh. What are we doing today? Let's get the party started. You know, I never get to relax, so today I just want to hang out by the pool. I think it is important for the ladies to unwind, feel pretty, and get glammed up. We're in D.C., okay? And we're wearing bathing suits. Yeah. We might as well party by this pool and invite some friends over. I brought a cute little bathing suit, uh, you know. I, I think mean, I saw your she cute bathing suit. It is suit. really cute, but to be honest, you know it's something for Italy. It's not for here. Yeah, honey. it's not for here. <laughs> I had played outside since I was a teenager. That's what happens, man, when you're a basketball star. Y'all don't play outside. I better finish you off before this thing gets out of control. Night, night. Like what? Wop! Oh, he... President Obama, wop! You got Ball me. Game. You got me. So this morning, Contessa and Heavenly were really nice to me. So they said, we want to steal you. They want to what? They want to steal me. They want to steal you. They go, you're the intelligent one. We want you on our side. Wow. No, wait. So basically, so that side is, is the intelligent. Yeah. Whoa. Oh. At this point, I'm just kind of over contesting heavily. Really? What the f does that mean, the intelligent side? It boils down to we don't have a medical degree. 
We have an MRS MD, and it's not the same to their MD. So we're not intelligent. Wow. Well, yeah, because we're not doctors. Anybody can be a dentist. <laughs> I'm just saying. I could have done that. Really? You can fix some teeth? Would you want to? I could no. not do that. I don't want to be <laughs> up in anyone's mouth. <laughs> They really said that today, this yeah, morning? Yeah, they said that this morning. What? That is so high school. That is. Who says that?